So basically, this is how the Fido app looks like. So after you download the app, um, you want to apply for the loan, you go to Get Loan. As you can see down here, you click on Get Loan. The app will load. And uh, it comes here. Yeah. So as a beginner, you'll be given an opportunity to apply for 200 Ghana cities and you choose the amount of days that you wish to repay back but kind of check the interest rates that you be paying let's check the interest how the interest uh, a fee of 12 cities and an interest of 31 cities 61 pesos so you know making 24 uh 243 Ghana cities 61 pesos as the loan that you, you pay then you continue from here you go to the first phase, you ask to fill your first name. Uh, let's say, let me use my name. Um, let's say uh, my first name, name um, and my last name. So um, from that, then you choose your date of birth. You choose, oh my God, oh my God. You choose the date of birth. I believe everyone can do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you do that, you do that, you do that, you do that, you do that. You select your date of birth. Then there is optional. You can use if if you have, you can use. If you don't have, then definitely is an option. So you can use any email. Then mark your your mobile money number you want to use. Then you type your mobile. Money. Let me uh, type in mobile money number for the uh, uh, zero two four four one two three four. Okay, you type in uh, and provide a second number, any alternative number that you you provide. Um, I'm using these numbers as an example. Then the identification. Here you have to be very careful. You have to know that um, the identification that you're using corresponds to the mobile money account name. For instance, maybe your ID card, you have the name Richard Asari. Richard Asari should correspond to your mobile money account. If it does not correspond, you will not be given the loan, period. So just understand. They want everything to be fair and sincere. So you choose the national ID that you want to use, voter's ID card. You type in. In your ID, uh, for instance, I'm using this exercise example. You type in the voter's ID numbers. Then from here, you move to the next phase. So here, you'll be required to, either you are married or not, uh, you are single. Um, are you currently in school? If you are in school, you're, uh, you're right, yes. Uh, if you are not in school, no. Uh, how many people depend on you for financial support? If people are depending on you, then you choose any option. But uh, if nobody is depending on you, you choose zero. Then your street name, your location. So your street name, I'm in Tema. So probably maybe I'll choose Tema, yeah. Then location, uh, my location is Community 3. Uh, community 3. Then your street name, um, you choose your street name, um, Korea. Korea Church, yeah. No, 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 no. I'm not in yeah. church. This is um yes, Korea. Let, let me use Korea Church. Korea Church, for example. Korea Church. Uh, uh yes, 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 yes. And uh, I think every street have name, but my yeah, the the very street name that's where is Korea Church. And uh, the house that you live in, is it a family house? Is it is it a land? Is it a rented house or what? If it's, it's your own house or family house, then you click a family house. And how long have you been staying there? Then you choose the option, whether two or less than two years or whatever. Two or more years, you choose it. And you add your box number. I have a box number. Box 574. Tema. I have a box number here. Yeah. So you fill all these details. And here you, you indicate the amount of salary you receive every month. Because it's very important. Because if you don't give them a, a very accurate, um, they 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 normally look at this to give the loans. Some of you probably maybe not give 
me receiving let's say 400 500 but it's important to choose between 350 to 700 for the stats if you are a self-employed you choose if you're already employed in any national service or what kind of self you choose anyway an industry even if, um um let me say um it's any of this you choose whether the industry is agriculture a banking service musician construction domestic service education um utility and uh, electricity entertainment and health okay all these all these are all these are the kind of one that you want to choose so you choose from these um industries but for me i'll choose from information technology and um and here i'll choose what do you sell or what do you i'll choose digital marketing what do you do there it's uh, talking about what you do there information technology digital marketing marketing yeah so from there how long have you been working two to four uh, two years and above so from here then you move to the next phase you understand the final the final the final step that you move in so here you fill in your your reference uh then you add reference name uh, let me uh, contact for you guys to see how it works so this is how um it works I'm just type in numbers so don't be bothered and the name uh richard Asar. richard Asar, a co-worker there's another person a friend of yours you choose his contact there's Two four three zero five. No 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 zero two four three six eight. Yeah, then you choose his name. Maybe Bright. His name is Bright. Make sure this information are accurate because they check all this information and make sure that um they are accurate because um probably maybe you may think that you are just typing in but you know these all things are very important. So you 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 will be asked of you will be required to refer three friends refer a uh, reference of three. Then you type all their names and their, their contact numbers. So let me see. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, and the name is Agnes. Oh, sorry. Um, Agnes. Oh, I'm up and this is a mistake. Forgive me. Agnes, sorry. A co worker. So they will require whether the loan that you need, that one, you can choose a personal loan you need a loan of personal and uh and you want to here you choose the more money uh more money that you prefer it have to be at least two months old then you type in more money let's say so five five six five and you type in then uh how well did you hear this these are very optional things and other stuff so uh, so from here you just submit and then you know you'll get you get your loan instantly so thank you very much for watching this video if you don't understand anything please kindly leave a link a uh, kindly comment and i'll definitely i'll show you how to apply if you don't understand anything you can leave a, a link below and i'll add you guys to subscribe to this channel and uh like uh click on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our future videos because we are going to educate you much about video money lending thank you very much for watching my name is Freddy C. and this is Danko TV and kindly subscribe to this channel thank you very much